In this section, we're going to talk about preparing graphics for Roku Direct Publisher. And so in this section, what we talk about is that you are going to choose the Roku Direct Publisher and you are going to pre-prepare the graphics you need so that when you actually get into the channel setup screen in your Roku account, you're ready to go and you have everything you need graphical wise in order to go ahead and create your channel. So with that, we're gonna learn the various graphics that you need and let's get started. So the first graphic that we're gonna need is a splash screen. So the splash screen needs to be 1920 by 1080. That's the size that uh, I would recommend. And um, I'm gonna show you where that splash screen goes. So I'm gonna switch off here and I'm gonna show you in my, um, in my cap and in, in my screen here. All right, so we have the channel selected. So I'm going to now select it. Splash screen is right there. Do you see that? Do you see that screen that came up before? We'll do it one more time. That's your splash screen. Opens up right when you start your channel. So that's the splash screen. And that splash screen needs to be 1920 by 1080. Let's go into the second graphic that you'll need. You're gonna need a channel logo. That channel logo is gonna to need to be 400 by 90. It's gonna need to be a JPEG or a PNG file. A JPEG or a PNG file. So let's go ahead and go over to um, the device and then let me show you where that logo is gonna go. You see the logo? You see the logo at the top? Okay, that's where the logo goes. This is the um, channel logo. Let's do it one more time. Right up there at the top. That's the channel logo. That's the position it will go in Roku Direct Publisher. And this is the size, 400 by 90. All right, let's go on to the next item that you're gonna need. You're gonna need a small logo for Roku Search. And it's a little more difficult to show you this particular uh, thing in, in the device itself. It's kind of hard to find. Um, but just suffice to say, you need to make a small logo, it is a requirement that is 165 by 60 JPEG or PNG file. I have always found that this logo um, is the most difficult to find. Um, I don't even know if this is really actively used, but Roku still has it on the requirements list. So I just would create a logo 165 by 60 JPEG and prepare that logo um, for input. Uh, the next logo you're going to need is you're going to need the channel poster. And let me show you where that channel poster is. So I'm going to go back here and I'm going to show you now. There we go. And I'm going to show you over here. I'm going to show you what this channel poster is. See that channel poster right there? Mm -hmm. That channel poster is this channel poster. So we're talking about a channel poster that you're gonna make. It's 540 by 405 JPEG or PNG image. That's 540 by 405, a JPEG or a PNG image. Let's go to the next graphical item that you're gonna need. All right, so the last graphical item that you may need in order to do this is a background image. So let me show you where that background image would come in. Go ahead and load the channel. Now you can see a little bit that the background is not completely black on this channel. It has kind of a shadow effect, a lot like you would see maybe in a photography studio when they were taking uh, your picture against a nice dark gray and and black background with a little graduations and light and dark patches within the background, making a nice marbled effect. So you can choose any background image you want, but this is where the background image would go in the channel. So let me switch back now. So let's go ahead and overview, uh, once again, the things you're gonna need. So 
let's go back here. You're going to need A, a splash screen. You're going to need B, your channel logo. You're going to need C, a small logo for Roku search. And then you're finally going to need a poster for your channel. And you're going to need a background image. These are all the items that you need to prepare uh, in order to move forward and have all the pieces and parts that you need uh, for the channel. All right, we're going to move on to the next section now.